You, uh, Halloween, of course. Halloween, New York City, man. You don't get any crazier than that. Yeah, yeah. I want to see that parade. Do you? It's, it my, it's, it's a, my it's my favorite opportunity because there's 4,000 cops on every corner. Yeah. It's coming up to him and going, I got to tell you, man, that is a great costume. <laughs> and, you know, <laughs> some guys laugh and some guys go, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Move hey, away. Hey, that gun looks real. real. Yeah, that gun looks uh, really yeah. real. Go, go, and then go to grab for it. Is that yeah. real, Mace? <laughs> <laughs> the only, I think... Uh, with the parade, I think the only cop uh, that wouldn't be a real cop that's dressed up is the one you see w- without an ass on his pants. Uh, <laughs> the cheekless cop. Yes, it's the uh, the cop from uh, the village people, nice. perhaps. There was a cop in there, yes, wasn't Victor there? Yes, Victor Willis, yeah, but I think he was the only straight one, allegedly. <laughs> Felipe Rose Victor was Willis. the Indian, <laughs> as we all so know. Well. And I think that uh, they were all... Uh, but they apparently Apparently homosexuals, uh, Glenn Hughes, and uh, apparently for, yes. only a guy that except would suck Willis. on an ice cube shot from a porn star's ass would know he would all know. the names. He would know. My the father took people. me to see them when I was a kid. For uh, what reason? <laughs> um, I think he wanted to break some news to me as he, uh, you know, daddy's roommate. No, he uh, <laughs> <laughs> he took me to see them in the opening act with Sister Sledge. We are family. Oh, we are family. family. Yeah. yeah, we all remember that. There you go. That's uh, of fantastic. Course. How, how, do you, how do you know that he wasn't the guy who won the cop? Because that was that was knowledge back then that he was a straight. He was Victor Willis was straight. He was replaced by another guy whose name like I don't Rock remember. Hudson and Freddie Mercury. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, no, they Freddie Mercury had a mustache. You idiot. You don't get more macho than that. He wore leather jackets. <sighs> he, he was as straight as they come, Mercury. <laughs> as I. Stroke my mustache. <laughs> <laughs> my brother was so depressed about Rock Hudson. It was Bloody the greatest yeah. look on his face. I went, you know. Rock Hudson's gay. He went, no, he's not. <laughs> I went, um, no, he's like really gay, actually. Um, no, mm, no. Did you hear him? Do you hear him talk? Does he sound gay? No, he doesn't sound gay at all. But he's like really gay. Uh, no, he's not. No, and, no. Uh, uh, and then he died denial. of AIDS, and I went, mm, what do you think now? He goes, um, s- n- mistake, a bad needle from something. Hemophiliac? Uh, yes. Yeah, exactly. Oh, someone, yeah. Was someone, uh, John, whatever his name, John Shuck from Macmillan and Wife gave it to him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure. I'm sure it was him. <laughs> Doris Day had AIDS. She passed it on. We always know she was riddled. She was just, she used to fuck people and say, que sera afterwards. <laughs> Jesus. God. Yeah, there was a, uh, we, uh, God, we, we would talk about, um, um, like Liberace would go on some of these talk shows, and Regis, <laughs> Regis Philbin is a guy who has no clue if someone's gay or not. They'll come on the show, and like years ago, Liberace would come on, and he'd be like, <laughs> "So Lee, you know, because they could call him Lee, all his friends. Lee, when are you gonna finally settle down and find a woman? <laughs> the women love you, Lee. Why don't you settle down? I'm he- just so busy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, know, I know my favorite. I, I, read, I just finished reading a Cary Grant book, and there was a point where Cary Grant and Randolph Scott. Scott were roommates. They were both making five thousand dollars a day, you know, in Hollywood in the in the thirties. Wow, nice we're, chunk. No, we're bunking together to save money. <laughs> we're just a couple yeah. of bachelors trying to, you know, make ends meet. And then the newsreel guy. Well, ladies, these two men are free <laughs> all the time. They're with each other always and looking for a fine l- lady. <laughs> really? Ah, uh, uh, yes. Yeah. 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 There was a story about two guys. They were, um, what were their names? Elmer and, uh, Elmer Gus. and Gus. And Gus. One of our be- favorite stories And ever. they were uh, real old. They were uh, in their 80s or something. And they finally were able to get married, I guess, in one of the states. And uh, they had been in World War II uh, together. And all I, uh, we could think about was uh, how the newsreel footage would be like, <laughs> they're home from war, ladies, and they're sure keeping their eye open for you. <laughs> You're just <laughs> for that salt, Peter, in their dinner. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they hadn't touched the girl, even in France. <laughs> you know, just not having a clue. Their arms are around each other. Buddies to the buddies. end. <laughs> yes. I'm sure during the war they had each other's backs. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about a foxhole. <laughs> yeah. One foxhole for these two. Hey, Cary Grant was gay? Dude, I didn't know Cary Grant, uh, he, he sort of liked a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Oh, I, oh, I, I always go. thought Cary Grant was Cary, the ladies' man. Cary Ooh. Grant, no, no. He, he would hang out with gorgeous women and drive them insane because he would not sleep with them. Ah. So right. he was gay. Oh, that's where I'm going. Yeah, because, uh-huh. you know, he was with... Pretty much every leading lady, and yeah. for some reason they never managed to hook up. <laughs> <laughs> because, Love that voice. That's great. Because him and 
Him and Randy <laughs> I thought he were had doing kids and everything, Kerry. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't he? Have yeah. Yeah. He does, of course, but that's yeah, how you used to do it in the old days. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I the need kids a child. I got to get me a side. kid. <laughs> Nowadays, they call it the DL. <laughs> Keeping it down on the DL. Wasn't James Dean was gay as well? Is that true? Really? James Dean? I don't know. I never heard that. I'd heard rumors that Look at us just outing old Hollywood No, I heard rumors that he was called. Spencer Tracy was a fruit. James Mansfield was a dyke and she threw her head into another pussy. No, his nickname was the ashtray. He used to like to go to parties and get cigarettes put out in his ass. His nickname was the, the ashtray. ashtray. The yeah, ashtray. You Google it. James Dean the ashtray. Google it. I'm not making well, these I'm things gonna up. I'm going to go to Snopes and see if they that's true. They probably call him that because some girl kissed him and he had smoked and he tasted like yeah. one. And then as the years go on, I like guys to put but, cigarettes out in his asshole. But ja like. James Dean's last alleged girlfriend was the woman who played Seinfeld's mum on Seinfeld. That sounds like... Uh, it's, it's true, it was in a documentary. Yeah, she Marilyn was, Manson was uh, the little kid's best hate, friend. Hey, he read it on the internet. No, it I did read true. it. On the, it was, on, true, a, it right? was on a biography it was on channel. A blog. She was young. <laughs> it was a documentary about him. The guy, they even mentioned in the side for She was extras. actually hot? No, she wasn't hot. That's she why was... he was gay. It's people are <laughs> keeping up with what I'm saying. He dated that big-nosed woman. He was obviously gay. So when he was in Giant... With Rock Hudson, what was going on in oh, that set? Oh, come on. my God. Come on, guys. Seriously. Oh, my God. You know, it's not that I didn't even think of that. Huh? Yeah, no, no. Oh, they was, they was, was that trailer rocking, don't tell it, other. Other. Yeah. There was scrotes on foreheads in that oh, movie. Oh, baby. It looked like the scene where they hit a gusher only in white. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Elizabeth Taylor was paying yeah. him to do awful things Horrid. in the corner. <laughs> Why no, should well, she just flick this off? Going, outed, I'm never going to marry either of you. <laughs> You're nothing to me. Now that we've outed all of Hollywood. I'm telling you, uh, James Dean was gay. All right, we're going to look into that. Who else, Bruce? Yeah. Very, else artist, very artistic. I'll think of many gay people and bring I'm them up. I'm just surprised. I didn't know that's what, that's what Bruce does. Just goes around and outs people. Yeah, well, I got a big list thing. and I dole them out. Yeah, one by one. <laughs> yep. Because what, uh, they owe me. What, what, are you, what are you in town for, in sir? Town?